out there. Um, I was going to do a video, but, uh, like, honestly, I'm tired, but I had to put this out there to the people that, um, will listen. It seems like this plagues and pestilence we're going to continuously be on this circle of motion. It's been almost three years since the first pandemic. And it's just been announced that a another pandemic is possible to happen. Um, all I can say is to be safe. We're all tired of being under this pressure. But at the end of the day, we have to look out for the safety of, of ourselves and the safety of our families, friends and loved ones. And this may mean that you can't do the things you want to do. You may have thought that it was time and that the sicknesses had died down. But obviously, they have not. And we have to make the adjustment. It doesn't seem like this cycle is going to ever stop. And for those of us who know scripture, unfortunately, it's not going to stop. So we have to persevere and do the best we can. Eat right fruits and vegetables, grains, fast, do different types of fast. If you feel you're not ready to do a fast like Christ, do a fruit fast. Do a juice fast. Do a water fast. And even if you're not able to fast right now, try to eat better. Get off of the meat. You have to get off of the meat. And go back to the way we were designed to eat without hurting animals and hurting people and destroying the planet. These are serious times and these are important times and we can't be playing around with this stuff. It's real. It's not fate. And at the end of the day, all we really have is our health. You can have all the money in the world. And if you don't have the correct health, if you're not healthy, all the money in the world all the friends in the world, all the prestige in the world, all the popularity in the world, everything, all the materials in the world, you will not enjoy because 
your health is failing. So the key to per persevering through these plagues and pestilence as best as we can is to challenge yourself to eat better fruits, vegetables, grains, beans, and trying to pass the good word on to other people so they can do the same. You can't force anybody, but if somebody asks you you can try to pass on that knowledge that you've gained to others. Y'all be safe out there. And God bless.